What's that noise coming from downstairs? Am I being burgled? Oh no! To help you avoid and better deal with flooding, there are a few simple steps you can take. The first thing to do is to check whether your property is in a zone identified as being at risk of flooding from rivers or the sea. If it is, sign up for any available flood warning service. However, be aware, surface water flooding from heavy rainfall can occur anywhere and isn't covered by flood warnings. If you think you might flood, it's a good idea to collect some items that could prove useful later on. Having these items set aside in an emergency flood pack will save you valuable time. Warm clothing in case you have no heating or if you have to leave your property. You may want to consider gathering personal items and important documents but only if it's safe to do so. Keep important documents in a watertight container, somewhere easy to get to and not on the ground floor. A torch, in case the power goes off. Don't forget spare batteries, or even get a wind-up torch. A first aid kit, in case you or someone else gets injured. If you have pets, think how you would keep them safe. Keep a carry box within easy reach in case you need to evacuate them. Some food and water are also vital. The water supply could be cut off or become contaminated. A few months ago you signed up for flood alerts and now you've been warned there could be flooding in your area in the next few hours. It's time to put your plan into action. Make sure you have your flood kit handy as well as any personal items you want to keep with you. Raise furniture and valuables off the ground and upstairs if possible. Stay alert and follow any instructions received from the relevant authorities. It's time to leave. Grab your flood kit and get moving. Be careful walking through flood water. There may be hazards hidden underneath, such as manhole covers which have come open. Do not drive in flood water. You'll make flooding worse in people's houses and you may end up getting trapped in deep water. Follow the instructions of the emergency services and you'll soon be on your way to safety.